everybody. Today we are here at the Ark Encounter here in Kentucky. And there it is, it's <laughs> Noah's Ark. You ready, Dawn? I'm ready. Let's, Let's do, do this. So we're on our way to the Ark. It costs $106.96. And uh, we're super stoked. We've been wanting to do this for a long time. And so it cost us $10 to park. And uh, we're on our way, right? We're gonna see who built the Ark. Noah, Noah, who built the Ark? Brother Noah built the Ark. A little too cold today for these feathery friends to be out. And there it is. It's the Ark and it's been windy here. <laughs> and it's cold. So yeah, we had a huge storm come through and it's been it's been crazy. But let's get inside the Ark and We ran into some friends here at the Ark Encounter. <laughs> oh, it was nice meeting you. Yeah. Here we go. Thank you. So this is what the inside of the ark looked like, Don. These are the little, like, pin, the pens that they put the animals in, you see? And they feed them. And here's the water. They put the water in there. Two of everything, Don. There's like two snakes, and two giraffes, and two elephants, and two dogs. I wonder if they had two, do you think they had two honey bears? I can hear them breathing. <laughs> yeah, it's just me. Yeah. Oh wow, here's the front of the ship over here. You hear the water crashing into the Dawn, there's a storm of brewing. It sounds like a storm is coming. And we're being tossed around on the water. I think I think the world's gonna flood. I think so. <laughs> Gosh, It could be, or food. Different types of food for every different type of animal. Oh, there's there's some bears. Huh. And this here is a sloth. That's the sloth. 
So the vessels are actually for the smaller animals, Dawn. You see that? So, yeah, we were wrong about the food. They were the smaller animals. Yeah. They even collected bugs. They collected bugs, Don. <laughs> yeah. Are those dinosaurs? Pterodactyls. Huh. Oh, yeah. Wow. Here's a model of the Ark, and at the back of the ship here, they had pins for like very large animals, like the uh, giraffes. And the smaller animals were put on the on the first level, and then they got bigger as they went to the top. Wow! So there was three levels, looks like maybe fourth level on top there. Yeah. And then back here in the back was uh, food and rations and stuff. So the first level was for all the smaller animals. Now we're going to level two. I guess this would be like the, uh, the mid-sized animals are up there. So deck two has got exhibits, restrooms, and, and a theater. One door to salvation. Yeah, Jesus is our door to salvation. And there's the the door there. That's a pretty big door. Yeah. Yes. Lots of room. Oh, yeah. I like the animatronics, don't you, Don? They're kind of like light. Yeah. <laughs> looks, <laughs> looks real. Fairy tale arc. Huh. So there's a little collection of all the different books over the years. Oh, wow, Dawn, I remember that book right there. I had that book when I was when I was little. I did. If I can't convince you that the flood was not real, then I can convince you that heaven and hell are not real. And it's got a serpent of some sort there. Everyone died except for the eight people in the ark. Are you gonna hug? Woodworking on the Ark. How did I find all the animals? Well, it really wasn't hard to find the animals, since God brought them right to me, just as he said he would. I just wondered when he would send them. We were nearly finished building the ark when hundreds of spectacular animals arrived. <laughs> I should have known. God's timing is perfect, and he always keeps his promises. How many animals are on the ark? That's a good question. There are about 1,400 kinds of animals on the Ark, and this works out to be fewer than 7,000 animals. Uh, I don't remember the exact numbers. I put my son Shem in charge of keeping track of those details. <laughs> How long did it take to build the Ark? Well, after our boys grew up, God told me his plans. He said the ark would be for me, my wife, our sons, and our sons' wives. It took us several decades to build the ark, but that was after years of designing it, collecting supplies, and preparing the site. Why don't I look 600? What do you mean? 
I look about the same age as any other 600-year-old person I've met. Well, except for my wife, of course. She doesn't look a day past 400. Oh. <laughs> if you say so, Imzara still as beautiful as she was on our wedding day. So in this room here, they're they're talking about how they got water to the animals and how they got rid of the waste. So they're they're explaining how the ark actually worked. And over here is ventilation. Uh, all the gases would, would seep to the roof and then, wow. A lot of these animals we're looking at have been extinct since the times of the ark. It looks like he's feeding these two guys down here. Are these the drafts, on? Oh yeah. But they're, they're miniature, they're miniature ones. <laughs> well, you know, they, they might have gotten bigger over the years. Yeah, yeah. What did the animals do when Noah's family is sleeping? Oh, let's find out. This one here says open here. Ah, hello. <laughs> <laughs> what? Are you are you okay? Yeah, I didn't expect that when I opened the door. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. There's a whole bunch of screaming. That, that one, it's staring at. Ah! What is that? It's, it's a it's a yeah. It's like a uh, it's a cat. <laughs> oh, there's. Oh, there's a dinosaur. <laughs> They're 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 hungry. There's no Looks like baby Godzilla's, don't it? Yeah. So I'm learning so much about the Ark. Uh, I love the animatronics that actually interact with you, and you can ask it questions, and it'll answer it. That's just really really cool, and they're they're lifelike. What do you think, Don? I think it's really neat. Yes. No, was actually talking to us. Yeah. You got any more questions? <laughs> so now we're heading to the third level. The living quarters. And this is what it was like living on the ark. I guess it was pretty comfy. Of course, after a hard day's work, feeding all the animals, taking care of them, you would definitely need a, at least a decent place to relax. And they had their own little garden on board here. Got fresh vegetables and, well, growing, growing food on the ark. And here's the living quarters of Ham and his wife. Huh. The rainbow sign, God said, he'll never flood the entire earth again. Well, there's a fragment of the gospel there. Wow. Let's exit through the gift shop.
Welcome to the Ararat Ridge Zoo. Dawn, there's, yeah, there's like Longhorn. Hello, guys and gals, or guys or, or gals. <laughs> oh, wow, look at the tortoise. Well, hello, porcupines. <laughs> Yeah, I, I bet you they're they're prickery ones, aren't they? Mm -hmm. I wouldn't want to mess with them. <laughs> I, I wouldn't either. I'm not one either. I think they like eating twigs. Hello. <laughs> He's a zebra, Don. It's cute. Oh, oh. Zebra, it's cold out yeah, here. it's cold. Uh, it's probably about 36 degrees, I would guess. Yeah, Christmas lights are looking pretty good. Unfortunately, we're not gonna be able to see them. We gotta get on the road to get back home. We still got four hours to Pigeon Forge. But I bet you the uh, the lights are pretty, aren't they? Yeah, I'm enjoying the Christmas. They got a nice little zoo, but it's so cold out. A lot of animals are inside, keeping warm. It was a neat experience. I'm glad I got to do it. Yes, it's something I've been wanting to do for a long time. My lips are cold. Yeah, the Ark is actually huge. Uh, it's just a massive structure. Definitely wear comfortable shoes because there is a lot of walking. Uh, the exhibits were really great. I love the old uh, gospels they had in there. The, the old pieces of like, the gospel for like over a thousand years ago, things like that. I really enjoyed them. Uh, I enjoyed the interactive animatronic figures. It was really cool. I thought it was really neat to see some of the animals on the ark and then the zoo was awesome. We went over to the restaurant and the restaurant was just super packed. Um, there was a waiting to sit down and we decided we weren't going to wait. But I did walk through and look at the uh, the food and the food looked really good, didn't you? Yeah. That looked really good. It did look good. It was like... It was just so packed. Yeah. And we decided not to, to do it. I guess the big question we ask Dawn a lot is, would you do this again? Maybe in a couple more years if they yeah. add on to it and stuff, or remodel, or I think add on. Yeah. I think if you've never been here, you have yeah. to. Um, and, and if you've been here for, I, I would definitely wait a few years. But folks, that's gonna do it for today. Here in Kentucky, here at the Ark Encounter. If you guys like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. We love you. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, Bye everyone. everyone.